Does the two-party system help or hurt democracy? By Deidre Barrett and Jiju Prophet. What is a two-party system? A two-party system is a system in which two major political parties compete to control government. Other parties may exist and may affect elections, but they rarely have enough support to elect a national leader or control the legislature. The United States has a two-party system. Although two parties control most government in the U.S. today, other parties do exist, such as the Green Party and the Constitution Party. However, these third party groups have nowhere near the influence of two major political parties. In the United States, the two party system hurts democracy. James Madison, a founding father of our democracy, warned later generations of the effect that factions, or known today as political parties, would cause if implemented in the government. Different opinions on major and minor issues have divided mankind into parties. These parties, fueled by their need for power, oppress each other rather than cooperate with each other for the common good. Two-party systems also create political gridlock which prevents legislation from passing and from the government effectively running the nation. The framers constructed the constitution in a way that a series of checks and balances would prevent one branch of government from overruling another. This requires each branch of government to work together hand in hand. An instance of political gridlock superseding the interests of the people in America is in the case of the anti-human trafficking bill of 2012. This bill would protect children and women alike from sex trafficking by providing stringent laws to combat its presence in America. However, in order for this to happen, the law must change to adapt to the ever so changing human trafficking industry. For some reason, Congress cannot come to an agreement on passing this bill. According to reporter Jonathan Suri, the polarized environment of Congress has led to the lack of cooperation between the political parties. Moral Black of Amori University states that political parties oftentimes will go against the opposing party's agenda to tip political party power in their favor. Congress must realize when to put political partisanship aside. Lastly, political parties are oftentimes influenced by interest groups, lobbyists, and the greed for money. Many times this can corrupt a party and compromise its integrity for the people. The NRA, which stands for the National Rifle Association, influenced government by luring congressmen to vote against gun control laws by giving incentives. According to the Huffington Post, one alternative to the two-party system lies in the idea of a four-party system. This idea of a four-party system is to be inclusive of a social conservative party, a liberal left party, a centrist party, and a libertarian party. These four parties would embrace American ideology and diverse views and values. According to Kristen Rilleritz of Benji State University, in the United States, women were significantly less satisfied with democracy than men. Race only included in the United States also showed that whites were significantly more satisfied than African Americans. Pertaining to budget cuts, the United Kingdom was more efficient in coming to political agreements.